Before we get into the video guys, if you guys want to be in with a chance of winning this Resurrectionist emblem, leave a like and tell me in that comment section what you're most looking forward to from Destiny 2. Can we reach 4000 likes? That would be absolutely epic if we could. What's going on guys? Today I bring you another Destiny video and today we're going to talk Daybreak what it is, what it means, and what it does. Okay, so over the past two weeks, Bungie have teased this daybreak. Deej has teased Mayhem Nightfalls, or Nightfalls with a Mayhem feel, and people have kind of put two and two together and come up with Mayhem Nightfalls. Bungie uh, streamed today talking about what this daybreak is. They confirmed it is a modifier which applies to Nightfalls. When it's on a weekly nightfall, which is now a 380 activity, the daybreak modifier basically takes in all the epic modifiers, so increased difficulty of all enemies, but it also gives what's believed to be a mayhem twists. It increases the rate of our ability recharge, so that be melee, grenade and supers. So it is basically mayhem motherfucking nightfalls, which I can't wait for. Now this daybreak modifier won't be on every nightfall from here on out. It will however be applied to nightfalls once every four weeks however from july 18th six weeks into august we will have nightfalls with this nightfall modifier at daybreak so that should be a pretty fun nightfall experience for them six weeks another thing they added or re-added to nightfalls are them sexy blue flames do you remember them basically back in the day for doing the weekly nightfalls which everyone rushed to do first uh, after the weekly reset due to these blue flames from nightfalls uh, basically once having it you gained an xp boost for the rest of the week that is coming back which is great now a couple of things to add when they were showcasing the blue flame buff during the stream did you notice the titans weren't in twilight garrisons well it seems as though with the Age of Triumph shaders will be applied to the Twilight Garrison which is great. Last thing to add is Shax and his weekly Crucible Bounty Quests. Each week after the 28th of March when the Age of Triumph hits, Shax will offer two weekly bounties for us to complete. So across all three characters, that's six chances of Nightfall tier rewards from Crucible which is also great because I love doing these things. But guys, that is it for another video. I have plenty more on the way, so stay tuned or subscribe if you're new around here. If you guys never want to miss out on a video, turn on the notifications by clicking the bell to get emails when I upload. Thanks as always though for stopping by. Do drop a like, I do appreciate the support and I'll catch you on that next one. Always in the wrong, knowing where we stand, but you and I. Get it right Left in the dark